Step training, the latest, most complete fitness workout that's perfect for everyone. Men and women, young and old, people of all fitness levels. And everywhere you find step training, you'll find Sports Step, the people who introduced the original equipment to complement this incredible workout. They make the steps that over 10 million people across the country and around the world are using to get into shape. As a fitness expert, I really like step training because it's a high intensity, low impact workout. Not only does it offer substantial cardiovascular benefits, but it can also incorporate strength building exercises for a complete fitness program. And while the intensity can be as high or low as you want it to be, the impact on your body's joints is only slightly greater than that of walking. And best of all, it's designed to accommodate people of all fitness levels, from the person who's just starting an exercise program to the well-conditioned athlete. Whatever you want from your exercise program, you can get it with step training. Today, we're going to perform a complete step training workout. By using this video several times each week, you'll see the benefits that step training offers a decrease in body fat, and more toned hips, thighs, and buttocks. It'll reduce your stress level and you'll feel better about yourself. Our workout will include a warm-up period with a stretch, a step training session, an abdominal toning segment, and finally a cool down. Now, let's look at the techniques and safety tips of step training. First is a basic step technique. When stepping onto the platform, Make sure that you're planting your feet directly in the center so that your heels are completely on the stepping surface. When stepping off the platform, plant your feet close to the step and try to do a toe ball heel fashion, keeping your knees slightly bent or soft like this. The only way you can make sure that you're stepping correctly is to look down at your feet occasionally. The stepping motion is a normal body lean, bending at the ankles, not from the hips or the waist. If you're just starting out, master the foot patterns before you add arm movements. And remember that the maximum step height should not exceed the point where your knee is higher than your hip. We'll be approaching the step from several different directions. From the front, from the side, and from a stride. From these positions, you can do a variety of step patterns. Here are some of the basic step patterns we'll be incorporating into today's workout. Do them with me now so that you can get used to them. First, the basic step with a right leg lead. To change to the left leg lead, we simply tap the foot as we bring it down and then bring it right back up again. Tap. We can also change the lead leg in the pattern by tapping up like this. Another basic move we'll be using is an alternating lead legs, which looks like this. Well, that's all for now. I'll explain a few other step patterns while we're going through the workout. Three times during our workout, you'll be taking your pulse to make sure that you're exercising within your target heart rate. To do this, take your first two fingers and place them on your wrist, just beneath the thumb, like this. You can also take your pulse at the side of your neck. Two fingers by your earlobe, come on down, four inches, across the front four inches by the Adam's apple. Finally. Drink lots of water before, during, and after your workout. That's about all you need to know to get started. So let's get into the workout. Okay, if everyone's ready, let's do it. Here we go. Slight bend in your knees. Buttocks tucked underneath. Abdominal strong. Shoulders relaxed. Get ready. We're going to move now. Rock side to side. You guys set? Four, three, two, let's hit it. It's up, two, now we're gonna do this four more times. Just four, three, split out in front, real strong arms right here. Oh yeah. Four more, four. Now diagonal those arms, right up to the sky, come on. Four more times, right here, four, three. Now bring it to the front, split it out, here we are. Mm. 
Bring it back up top. Four times. Oh, yeah. Back to the front. Let's go. Hit it. Strong. One more time. Just like that. Let's go. Way up. Back to the front. Come on. Hit it. Out here. That's it. Last set through. Right now. Bring it four. Three. Now push those arms to the side. Eight. Right here. Got it. Again. Four more. Yeah. All the way down. Press it through. Nice. Four more. Now push it outside. Four. Hit it. Yes. And all the way down. Four. Right here. Back to the side. Four. Come on. Press. Now bring it back down. You know this part. Double punch. Side A. Hit it. Right here. Now nice and strong. Shoulders up. You got it. Four. Push it down. Eight times. Right now. That's it. Keep going. Four more. Now double punch. Four. Hit it. <laughs> That's it. And down. Mm. Good. One more time. Double punch. Hit it out. And down. Nice. Now we're going to go through the whole thing again. Punch it front. Four times. Out. Diagonal up. Come on. Lift up. I hope you feel comfortable with these movements. Push it away. Warm it up. All the way down to the floor right here. Push it. Wonderful. Double punch. Side. Now. Yeah. And down. Press out. That's it. Now hands on your hips. Here we go. Chain. We're going to bring our feet side to side together. Right now. Pull it in. Good. Now low row. Hit it here. Four times. Strong. Add that clap. Yeah. Mm. Roll it back. Come on. Pull it. Good. Now clap. You've got it. Starting to feel good. Pull it. Yes. Now clap it. Right here. One more time like that. Let's go. Pull it back real strong. <clears throat> now clap it. Here we go. Yes. Now hands on your hips again. Just four. Four. We're going to march in place. Right now. Hit it out. Good. We're going to use this step now. So you become more comfortable. When we get into the workout, you'll know how it works. Just four, three, come up on top and march eight. Let's go. Look down. Watch for your stepping. Four, three, come on off to the back, right here. How's that feel comfortable? Let's go again. There we go. Just four more times. Four. Now come off the back. Let's go. Right here. Nice. Now we're going to do alternating taps. Bringing one foot up onto the step and then off. Four, three, start with that right leg. Let's go. It's up. Good. Nice. Four more times. Now add a chest press to this. Let's go. Down. Yeah. That's it. Four more. Good. Hands on those hips. Here we are. Look down. See where you're stepping? Get comfortable with this. Four, three. Let's march in place. Right here. Hit it. Yeah. Now the feet come out to the side. And the heels are going to become very silent. Lower it down. Nice. Now the heels don't even move. Hands on the hips. We're going to turn to your right. Let's go. Look at your toes and your heels. They should be going right towards one wall. Hands on the hips. We're going to be coming up, bringing the back heel off the ground. Arms up and pull it down. You guys sight? Four, three, let's go. Row it up right now. Pull it down. That's it. Mm, just four more times. Come on. Up with us. Now this is a three stretch movement. Two left. One more. Now we're going to hold the stretch. Here we go. Hands to the front thigh. Back heel pressed to the floor. You should feel comfortable. Now the chest is strong, square towards the wall. Back is an arch. Okay, we're strong. Four. Three. Rotate back right towards us. Here we are. Now, hands out front. Press away. This is separation for the shoulder. You should feel comfortable too. Four. Three. That's it. Here we go. Hands back. On our buttocks. Pull the shoulder blades together. A nice stretch for the chest. Let's go back out front. Here we go. Press away. That's it. Hold it. Pull the floor. Now the knees are still bent. Buttocks tucked under. Hands back. Come on. Pull it. That's it. Chest stretch. Excellent. Hands on your thighs now. Here we go. Relax that lower back. Good. Now push the pelvis underneath. The buttocks right here. Abdominals should be strong. Put your hand there. Feel it. The muscles should tighten up. Hold it. For four. Relax again. Here we go. Ah. Oh, should 
Feel good. Now, back up. Buttocks underneath, abdominal strong. Hold it there. Four, three, let's roll it up right here. We're gonna switch to the other side. Turn it to your left. Now, toes and heels, remember? Directly lined up with your wall. Let's get into it, raise it. Up and back, again, reach and pull. Heels off the ground. A little more movement before the stretch. Three, here we go, two left. Last one, hold it here. Hands on that front thigh and fence. Back heel pressed to the floor. Lean forward, but don't arch that back. Real strong. Four. Now, come on back to the center. Watch this, shoulders come up towards our ears, ready? Mm. Now, press to the ground. That's it, just like that. Nice. And again, way up, shoulders by the ears, and press away, all the way to the ground. Well, another low back stretch. Let's go, hands on those thighs. Relax the back, and then pull the pelvis underneath. The buttocks comes under, abdominal strong. We did this before. Hold it there. Switch it, and again, let's go, relax. <laughs> That's it, Hillary. Hey, come on up and hold it, strong, abdominals tight. You got it. Let's roll it up to the top. Mm. Feet come together, now take your right leg, the heel, on the step. The opposite leg, both hands are there to support. Lean forward, press the buttocks back. It's a wonderful stretch for the hamstring. Hold it there, hold it right there. Four, three, two. Now do this, flatten that foot that's on the step. The opposite leg, bend it. Hands on your hips. Now this is a stretch for the Achilles and the soleus, which is part of the calf in the back of your leg. Now let's switch. Other side, left leg up, heel on the step itself, hands on the bent leg. Come forward slightly, the buttocks pushes back. Hold that stretch, it should feel comfortable. Now if it's too intense, bend the knee a little so it feels good for your body. Now, here we go, relax that foot. It's flat on the step, the back leg bend down, hands on your hips. Feel it right there, okay? Excellent. Hold it for four. And relax. Both feet on the ground. Well, now you're ready to start stepping. We want you to join us with the right leg down. Okay, so when ours is down, we want yours to be two. It'll make it so easy. You'll be in sync with us. First movement is a right leg lead. We're going to be stepping up on the step with the right leg. Ready? Four, three, two. Come on up with us. Here we go. It's up and back. Just the right leg. Look where you're stepping. Two more. Then a slow roll. If you're ready, add those arms. Let's go with us. Control. That's it. Again. Yeah. Look down. Watch where you're stepping. Just three left. Here we go. And two. We're going to change those arms to a bicep curl. Nice and slow. Powerful. Here. Yeah. Keep looking where you're stepping. Body is erect. Mm -hmm. And again. Let's go. Three more. All right, just two. Last time. Now the hands on the hips, because we're going to slow it down in a minute to change or the legs tapping with us. If you're ready, four, three. Here we go. We're going to switch. Tap down. Last one. Hit it here. Tap it. All right, now left leg is leading. Look down. Watch where you tap. Two more. Last one. Now a fast low row. Are you ready? Hit it. Yeah. Got it. Right there. And again. Good job. Look where you're stepping. Four more. Three. Only two. Now we're going to change it to a bicep curl. Ready? Hit it here. Right up. You got it now. Deep step. Yeah. Oh no. Four more. Oh yeah. Hit it. Just two. Last time. Now the hands and the hips, just like this. Now we're going to slow it down. Really slow it down this time. We're going to bring the knee up, alternating. One more step. Now watch us and join. Okay, here we go. It's step, knee, off, and switch through the other side. So it's step, knee. Let's do that one more time each side. Here we go. Step, knee, other side. Let's switch. Step, knee. Now bring that up to temple with us. Are you ready? Step, knee, good. And again, up, dynamite. One more time. And then add those arms across. Crisscross. Mm, strong. Yeah, just two more times. Last one. Now the arms go down. Right here. Come on, power. <laughs> Got it now. 
Jordan again. Two more. Last one. Let's add those together. What do you say? Across, now down. And again. Now down. Yeah. Keep going. Watch where you're stepping. Four more. Three left. Keep going. Only two. Last time. Now the hands go on the hips. Right here. Knee comes up. Out to the side. Just a little bit. One more time. Then we're going to follow that knee. Travel right here. Up. Good. Again, two more times. Yes. Last one. Now add those arms up. Let's go. Real strong. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Twice more. Last time. <laughs> now bring them down. Right here. Strong. Powerful. Good. Watch your foot placement on the step. Again. Let's add those together right now. Up and down. Yeah. Up and down. And again. Dynamite job. Four more. Oh, yeah. Three. Only two. Yeah, there we go. Now the hands and the hips, we keep traveling for four. Good. Then we're going to stay over on this other side, okay, right here. One more set across. And tap up for four. Up and down. We're going to change this to a knee up. Two left. Yeah, let's get that knee into play now. Ready? Here we go. Knee up. Step knee. Excellent. Again. That's it. Last time. Now chest pressing down with those arms. Let's go. Strong and down. Good. Strong and down. Again. Watch where you're stepping. Foot placement is critical. Four more. Three left. Just two. Last one. Hands on those hips. Now we're going to increase the intensity of the arms a little bit. We're going to do a power pump. Two left. And again. Let's pick it up here. Arms. Strong. That's it. Watch where you're stepping. And again. Real powerful arms. Four more. Four. Now three. Then two. Last one. Hands on the hips. Right here. Let's go. Four more. And we're going to switch to the other side. Two left. Last one. Let's go right now. Over. Silly knee. Up. That's it. Knee goes up. Then we're going to add the same arm. Remember the pressing down? Last time. Let's go. Right here. Pushing down. And again. Nice job. All right. Now watch where you're stepping. Foot placement again. Be safe. Secure in the center. Three more. And two. Last one. Hands come back on those hips. Four, four. Then you know what's next? Increase that intensity. Two more. I'm going to power pump those arms. Let's hit it. Right here. Real strong. That's it. With us. Now we'll be four. And three. Two to go. Last time, hands on the hips. Keep that knee with us. Now we're going to travel again, okay? Two more times. Go back and forth with us for four. Let's hit it. Right now, bring that knee up. Now the arms are going to crisscross again. And then go up. You ready? Hands up here. Let's go. Bam. Real powerful. Two left. Oh, yeah, just one more. Now arms go. Well, good job. Come on, have fun with us. That's what we're here for. Last time. Now let's combine it together. Crisscross. Now up. Crisscross. And up. Yeah. You got it. Oh, more. More, more. Come on. Only two. Last one. Hands back on those hips. Let's go. Knee up. Now we're going to change the foot here. It's going to go with a hamstring curl. One more time, just like the knee. Now over here, add a hamstring. Heel up the buttocks. Good. Two more times like this. Then we're going to add a tricep press now. Right here. Guys, set. Yeah. And again. Powerful, powerful. One place to remember is critical. Four more. Look down. About every other step. Last one. Now bring this movement into the center. Ready? Right at us. Come on. You feeling great? <laughs> I hope so. Four more. Here we go. Just three. Now two. Last one. Change those arms to a row. Ready? Powerful. Mm, legs stay the same. Hamstring curl. Heel up towards the buttocks. Now if you want to follow these guys behind me, we're going to pick up the speed with the arms. 
but you can stay with me. Whatever feels most comfortable for your body. Last time, hands on those hips. Now we're gonna change this heel to a tap up. Two more. Last time, let's change it right here. So it's tap and down, switch. Tap, see now we're gonna alternate, okay? Like that. Now the arm's gonna come in front, pull it back, right here. Strong. <laughs> yeah. Listen to the guys behind me. You got it. Four more times like this. Here we are. Look down. Watch your foot placement. Critical. Two left. Now we're gonna add a little pull in the middle. So watch. It's one pull side, now middle. Yeah. Middle. That's it. Side then middle. A little more variety for you. Four more. Three left. Two. Last one. Hands on those hips. Keep going. Four more. Now three. Only two left. We're gonna box your place. That's it. Right here. Hit it. Got it. Hit it. Now remember, pay attention to your body and the intensity at which you are working out. If you feel like this may be a little too much for you, that's okay. Drop your arms and go through with the step movements with your legs. Or if you choose, you can even do this whole routine off of the step until you feel more comfortable. Pay attention to your body. Have fun. Remember, this is for you. Well, now we're ready for the last part of the step workout. Turn to the side of your step just like this. Now we're going to come up on top and march for eight and then do a movement called the straddle down. You guys set? Yeah. For four, three, then come on top and march for eight. Let's go, right here. Feel comfortable, look down. Now listen, we're going to go real slow. Take a foot off the front and then off the back. Let's go. Four, three, two, step it off with me right now. Off, off, now up. And again, ready? That's it. And up. Again, let's go slow so you feel comfortable, but where your feet should go. Last time. That's nice. Now, let's bring up the tempo. Here we go. Great. Yeah, that's it. Two more times. Excellent. Now, let's add a slow, low row. Out and strong. Look down at your step. See where your foot placement is. Four more times. Let's go. Just two. Last one, let's pick up the tempo right here. Out and in, yeah, you got it now. A little quicker arms, legs stay the same. Let's go, we're four, and three. Nice job, two, last time. Now with our hands on the hips, let's go, right here. Keep that foot going, but we're actually gonna slow it down. Okay, two more times. Down, that's it. Now here we go, ready, slow. So it's off, off, now up, and again, ready? Off, off, now tap it, right here. Down, down, we've switched the leg now, okay, so the back leg is a lead. Off, off, are you ready to go to tempo? Yeah. Let's hit it. Dynamite. And again, one more time, then arms press up, ready? Let's go, slow and strong. Good, look down at your step, watch your foot placement, it's critical. Again, four more. Dynamite. Only two. Come on. I don't know what it is. Last one. How about arms tempo? Real quicker. Yeah. We've got it now. That's nice. And again, four more. And three. Two. Last time. Now the hands back on the hips. Four. Bring it down. Change to a knee up. Two. Last time, now we're going to slow it down again. Watch this. It's off, off, then come back up. And again, off, off, up, up. Now watch, off. Now we're going to bring a knee into place right here. Up in the air, again. Good, back knee. Now let's go, come on, down. Knee up, got it. Right here, again. Two left. Last time. Let's go with those arms. And hit the heel. There. Good. Again. Hand to heel. Strong. Great. Keep going. Beautiful move. Come on. Yeah. Three left. Let's go. Just two. Now the arms change. We're going to come down. Ready? Right here. Arm. Good. Knee up. Arms down. You've got it. Real powerful here. 
One more. Three left. Only two. And you know what's next? We're going to combine them together. It's like this. Up, now down. Up, now down. That's it. Powerful, strong stuff. Here. Mm. Yeah. Just three more times. Now two. Last time through. Hands on those hips. Mm. Knee goes up. We're going to change that knee. Two more times. To a kick. Ready? Yeah. Let's do it now. Get out there. Good job. Two more. Last one. Now we have chest press out. Right here. Uh, good. Like that. Powerful. Nice. Again. Four more times. Uh, now three. Just two. That's it. Let's press it down. With us. Yeah. Again. Uh, good. A kick. Watch your step placement, okay? The foot should be in the center. Again. Yes. Yeah. Three left. Now two. Then we're going to add them together. Last one. Ready? Let's go. And again. Strong. Out and down. There you go. Yes. Uh, good. Combination arms. Three more. And two. Last time. Good. Hands on your hips. Kick. We're going to change that foot now to a heel. Yeah. Two more times. Like that. Last one. If you're ready, bring it to a heel. Right here. Hit it. Yeah. yeah. We got it. Two more. Last time through. Now butterfly with the chest right here. Strong. Okay. Arms are up. Chest level. Yeah. Got it. With us. Mm. One more. Now three. Only two. Last time. Now a low row. Cross the front chest. Here. And again. Good. Right there. Yes. Come on. Try to hang in there. Forward, guys. Yeah. Just two. Last time through. Combine it together. You ready? Let's go. Low. Chest. Now low. You've got it. That's it. With us. Watch where your foot placement is. One more. Three left. Only two. Then hand goes on the hip. Four here. Yeah, strong movement. You got it. Last two. One more time. March on top here. Hit it. Dynamite job. Now what we're going to ask you to do is turn and face us. We're going to come off the step, but I want you to look down, okay? Be really careful with this movement. And we got a few more things in store for you. Ready, guys? Yeah, ready. All right. Bring it out. Three, two, and up. Hit it. Yeah. Now we're going to slow it down and we're going to come up one time, leg at a time with a tap. If you're ready, let's slow it. Just four, three, two, right leg up. Hit it. It's up, up. Now down and tap it right here. Let's try that again. Up, up, and tap it. Now go. Hit it. Yeah. Tap. Good. And again. Excellent. Two left. Last time through. Good. Now we're going to do a little movement like this where we widen our stance. Okay? How's that feel? Comfortable? Good. And across. Four more. Three left. Only two. Then we're going to add an arm punch. Last time. Let's bring it back across. It's right here. Now punch this arm. Bam. And again. Hit it out. Nice. Let's go. Four more. Yeah. Again. Just two. Last time. Now we're going to add a cross in the center. Ready? So press. Here, not punch. Hit it. Press. Again. Nice and easy. Good. Watch your foot placement. On the step. Again. Three left. Come on. Now two. Last time. Now the arms go up in the center. So it's a punch. Now up. Strong. And punch. Up. Strong. That's it. Up. Strong. <laughs> oh, we're wrapping it up here real big. That's it. Three. You've got it now. Just two. Yeah. Last one. Back to the center of the arms. Push it. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> We've got it. Yeah. Hope you're having fun with us at home. Four more. Just three to go. Come on. Hit it. Now two. Last one with the center. Now just a punch at the side. Here. No center. Uh-uh. Punch it. That's nice. There. All right. Four more times. Hit it. Yeah. Good. And again, yeah, two. Last 
everyone with a clap. Did it here? Real strong. Come on. Watch that foot placement. Have some fun with us here. We've done a dynamite job today. Oh yeah. Heart rate check coming up. Just three and two. Last time, hands on the hips, right here. Come on across. Dynamite, right there. Now we're going to start to bring it center. Just a little bit. Bring down that curve. Three left. Now two. Now we're going to march in place. Last time, march it here. Hit it. Now get ready for a heart rate check. You know where to find it. Either at the wrist, the carotid, at the neck. If you're ready, get set and count. Look once again at that chart. Make sure you're within your age range. It's really important. But well, we're going to start bringing it down a little bit now, okay? Let's have our feet come out to the side. Real easy. Hands on your hips. Good. Good. Stay strong. Now the heels become silent, like this. Excellent. Now we're going to rock side to side. Four, three, bring it over with us. Let's go. Come up. That's it. We're going to bring all the movements down. Four, three. Now the hands come across the front. Punch it. Just easy. Light movements, cooling down. We'll be taking a recovery heart rate a little bit too to make sure you're within your safe range. Here we go. Just four, three, two, both arms press down. Right here, easy, easy. And keep your hands down as low as you can. Just four, three. Now back to that punch for four, ready? Easy movements, that's it. Now press it down together. Good, hope it feels comfortable for you. Punch it out. Now press together with us. Hands on those hips. Let's go right here, strong. And then the feet come side to side together. Ready? Now. And again, just four, three. Now pull those arms back nice and easy. Now the foot placement here, you know, keep them close together. We're not trying to increase the heart rate by any means. We're bringing it all the way down. And again, for four, three. Now cross in front, real low row. Right there. Good. Again. Four. Now pull it back four times. Here we are. Nice. And across the front low. Four times. And back again. Low row. Easy. Easy movements. Here we go. Final chapter. Across. Great. Then hands on those hips. Easy. Good. Then march it out with us right here. Yeah. Feet come back out again. Separate. What feels comfortable for you. Now the heels are silent. Right like that. Great. Buttocks underneath tucked. Bending your knees. Domino strong. Shoulders relaxed. Bring those arms out front again. Right there. A nice stretch for the upper back. Hold it. Hope you feel dynamite about joining us today. I hope you had a lot of fun because I know we did. Back in front. Now back. Right here. Pull it. Chest stretch. Hold it. back in front. Reach it out. Come on. Towards us. Give us what you have right here. Nice stretch. Now back. Hands behind. Pull at the chest. There. Then hands on your thighs. Lower back one more time. Relax it down. You know this from the beginning. I'm sure you remember. Pull it up strong. Yeah. Hold it. Now abdominals tight. <laughs> it's good. Does that feel nice, Lord? Yeah. And relax again. Good. This is reward time. Pull it up. Hold it. Like that. Now roll it up. Here we go. Now come on top of your step. We're going to do a stretch for the calf. Just like this. Take your right foot back. The ball of that foot on the edge. Now listen, this is an extremely strong stretch for the calf, so don't overdo it. Press that heel to the floor. The back leg is straight. Hold it. If it starts to hurt, then you're overstretching, so just release up a little bit. Hold it right there. Excellent. Now, bring feet up. Let's bring both feet together. Now, this is going to be a stretch for the Achilles in the back. Bend those knees straight back. And also the soleus, which I mentioned before, is part of the calf muscle. Hold it. Now, let's switch to the other side. Here we go. Left foot back. Ball the foot on the edge of the step. Press the heel towards the ground. But don't overstretch. Now, this is important. 
Almost there. Good. Now both feet back up on the step. Now let's look where you're going. Step off. We're together. And now it's time to take a recovery heart rate. You know where it is by now. Either at the wrist or the neck. Find it. Go ahead, find that pulse. And go. And stop. Take a look at the chart to make sure you are in an acceptable range in regards to recovery heart rate. If you're a little elevated right now, step side to side like this until the heart rate comes down to a level that you can join us on the floor. If you haven't taken the time to get anything to drink throughout the whole workout, this would be a perfect time to do that. Well, let's grab our mats so we can go to the floor and do some wonderful abdominal work. Well, we're going to all go down together in a safe format, of course, and begin the abdominal section. Here we go. Arms up. Take a big breath. And exhale. Hands right on your thighs, just like this. Now, take your right arm onto the floor, and that leg, the opposite arm, and that leg. Then come on and get on your mat, and we're going to rotate so you're on the back, just like this. Now, you'll notice that Andrea has her feet up on the step, and the reason being is that it automatically puts a person into a pelvic tilt, so the lower back is flat on the floor, just like that. Now, come on up where the shoulders are off the floor. The hands are behind the head. Now, they'll support the head, but I don't want you pulling on the head itself. Okay, if you're ready, we're going to begin real slow. Let's bring it up for two and relax for two. Come on up, contract, and exhale every time through. Let's go. Bring it up real slow. Now, this may be slower than you're used to, but this is the most effective way to work the abdominal system. Again, let's go back and through. Three left. Come on. Give it to us. Press that lower back into the floor. Wonderful. Mm. One more time. Bring it up and hold back and through. Now, if you're advanced and if you'd like to continue to go like Andrea is showing you right now, you can do that. Or if you want to take a rest, do that now. We're going to switch and do some oblique work. Now, the next muscles are the obliques. These are the muscles that run along the side of the body, part of the abdominal system. I'm going to come on down with Hillary and help you through this. Now, the first thing you want to do is take the leg closest to us and bring it up across that foot, across the other knee. That's going to stay stationary. The idea here is to bring the elbow across towards that knee. Don't pull on it with your head. Think of shoulder towards the knee. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go slowly. Up and across, back and down. Exhale, breathe every time through. Again, we have the foot and the leg bent on the step, and that allows us to keep that lower back flat. Contract through, back, and again. Here we go. Four more. Come on, give it to us here. Contract every time, but keep breathing. Dynamite. Again, just two more. Last one. Bring it up, across, and relax right here. Now we're going to switch legs. We don't want one side of the body being wonderfully toned and the other one not. So if you're ready, get in position. This leg is stationary. Let's go. Come across here back and again and what look at this on Hillary too the elbow she's not worrying about bringing that through it's the shoulder that's concerned right and back again exhale breathe every time here we go four more breathe every time through on the way up exhale lower back is still pressed to the floor and up that's it we're gonna do one more just like this here we go up across back and relax. Now, let's go back, put both hands behind the head, both feet are on the step, and go through one final set of abdominal lifts. If you're ready, lower back press to the floor, let's go. Bring it up, contract, back, and again. Now, with this movement, too, we're looking once again with the back press against the floor, and you come up as high as you can. If you feel strong, go ahead and go through with it. Or if you want to take a break and relax, that's okay, too. Let's go. Four more. Breathe. Good. And again. Just two more times with us. Exhale every time up. Last one. Really contract. Come on. Through. Yeah. Wonderful. And relax. How do you guys feel? Good. It's good work. When you do it this slow, it's that much more effective. Okay. Let's roll to one side, towards us, towards television. And I'm going to pull the step back. At home, do the same thing. 
That way we can stay on the mat to do our stretches. Okay, the first stretch we're gonna do is gonna be for the quadricep. Now this is what I'd like you to think about. Have the bottom leg bent. That's gonna allow you to be balanced so you're not gonna lean forward or back. Grab the heel or the ankle to get a nice stretch through the quadricep and hold it right there. Now, if you want to increase the intensity of the stretch, just push your knee, the top leg, back a little bit towards the back. Hold that stretch. You know, this is one of the muscles that we've really worked a lot today. And this is a great opportunity to stretch it, to reward the muscle by stretching it. Quadricep stretch. Hold it there. Okay. And slowly release. Now, come on up to an elbow and bring your feet to the front. I'm going to go through here a really wonderful stretch for the hamstring. Now, this is the opposing muscle group to the quadricep, the thigh. Let's come on down towards your feet. Walk your hands on the floor. Now, that's support. Here we go. If you'll see right here, there's a great bend in the knees. We don't have to have the legs flat to be effective. Hold that stretch. How does that feel? feel yeah, great. Now, if you're more flexible, like Hillary is, you can see that her legs are almost flat across the ground. And you can lean forward wherever it feels comfortable to you. Hold the stretch, and release. Now let's switch to the other leg, the quadricep that we haven't done, and we're going to do the same position. I'm going to come back over to Hillary. Here's the movement. The bottom leg is bent, beautiful, and there's a nice stretch right here. Now if you want to bring the knee back just slightly further, just like we're demonstrating, you can get a little more intense stretch to the quadricep. Hold it there. more seconds. Once again, it's a reward for the muscle. And relax. Come on up on your elbows. And then to your knees. And let's take our right foot right here. To the front. Hand on that thigh. Other leg up. And roll it up. Hey, we had a great time with you today. It was wonderful. Hillary, thanks. Andrea. And we can't wait to see you again on your Next Step Workout. Tim Caldwell, Master of Ceremonies for several of the 92 regional competitions. I had the opportunity to witness many great performances by some really incredible athletes. And now, you have the opportunity to work out with the best. Let's meet them. Let the bass kick. Make it fun. Make it fun. First, make sure you choose the best step height. Make sure the knee is always kept comfortably below the hip level. If the platform is too high, you risk overstressing the knee. Always step to the center of the platform using a natural full body lean. Make sure the foot makes complete contact from heel to toe. Do not step with the knee continually flexed. Extend the knee fully, but be careful not to hyperextend or lock it like this. When stepping down from the platform, step closely to the step. 
again making sure the foot makes contact with the floor, this time from toe to heel. Between certain segments, we will be taking a pulse check. You may also use the pulse check at any other time you feel the need. Find your pulse at either the carotid artery, with two fingers just below the jawline, same hand, same side of the neck, or at the radial, with two fingers just below the thumb. Now upon instruction, begin your count starting with zero, and continue for the 10 second count. A chart like this will appear, find your age range, and make sure you are working within the highlighted training zone. Now don't overexert yourself to the point of extreme fatigue. You should always feel good during and after the workout. Disco. 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 Here we go. 
for three. Here we go. Tap raise. Back to taps on your right. Tap on your right. Here we go. Bring it up. Okay, now eventually, tap string. Those taps are going to become basic. Walk three. Okay, that'll be the next time around. Tap raise. Now we're going to tap one more time on our left. On your step. Here we go. Hamstring, hamstring. Step touch. Walk for three. Take it back to center. Okay, guys, now we're going to go into a basic right foot for two. Here we go. Just a little bit. Hamstring for two. Just a little bit. touch. Walk it. Just a little bit. Tap raise. Four. Just a little bit. Three, guys. Basic left. How are we doing that, there, champ? Lift it up off the ground. Hold it down. Bicep curl. Here we go. Lift it. Down. Now be careful. Do not let, let your back arch in this position. Wrap tight in your glutes. Twice more. Once more that we hold that bicep curl. Here we go. Hold. Okay. Drop that hand to your thigh. Stretch that leg back slightly. Now give me a little pelvic tilt. Sink down into it. Here we go. A little hip flexor. Watch the step stretch. Hold it. You guys are doing great out there. Okay, lift the body. Drop the heel. Feel that calf stretch. Feel it there. Yeah, just let it stretch. Four more. Three, two, and one. Okay, adjust that foot into the step. Flex the upper foot back. Raise your hands up on your quads. Drop your chest. Hold. Soft knee here. Not too hard on that hamstring. Okay, give me point flex. Here we go. Four. Three. Two. And hold the point. Hold. Step. Place that foot back. Step on it. Roll it up. Step. Reach. Here we go. Reach. Keep going. Come on. Give me four more. Four. Three. Two. Now hold this foot. Lift it up one more time. Lift. Combination. Bicep curl. Go through the back foot. Lift it. Woo. Twice more. One more than we hold that bicep curl. Hold. Two. And on your side. Relax that foot back. Little pelvic tilt. There we go. Sink. Feel that in your hip flexor. Quadriceps. Hold it. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Lift it up, guys. Lift. Drop that heel. Feel that calf stretch. Okay. Okay, pull that leg into the step. Flex it back. Hands position up. Drop the body. Joy. How we doing back there? Hold. Point and flex. Here we go. Four. Three. Last two. Hold the point. Hold. Step on your step from your lower back. Release. Slowly roll it up. Okay, everybody. Right. Step it out. Last two deep breaths. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. Exhale. Okay, you guys ready to start stepping? All right. Everybody at home, take it down to one knee. Very carefully pick it up and turn your step. Okay, Kim, Harold, and I are here to get you started stepping. Team champions will join you later. Four more march. Three. Okay, basic step, right foot. Here we go. Basic arms. Basic arms, guys. Okay, two more. Doing great. Left foot change. Here we go. Ha, ha. Woo, how are we doing, everybody? Okay, change it up. Right foot. Okay, now keep those four. Keep those four basic steps. Two more. One more. Switch to your left. Here we go. Okay. All right, guys. We're going to change up these arms a little. Ready? Here we go. Ho. Okay, arm straight. Big circle. Little circle. Push and change. Here we go. Ho. Remember, people.
with those fours. Now you'll see these arms later. You'll see these arms a little later on, a little faster. Doing great. Woo! Ha! Big circle. Little circle. Change it up one more time. Now this is gonna be our last time, then we'll move on. Big circle. Okay, guys. Drop your arms. Alternating knees. Here we go. Knees up. Ooh, hold it here. Okay, guys. How are you doing, champ? Hey. Woo! Now this combination starts with two knees right here. Now bring it up. Basic. Off to the side. Down. Tap. Two steps off the back. Two knees. Bring it up. Woo! Alternate. Bring it off to the side. Tap it out. Two steps off that back. Here we go. Stop those arms when you're ready. Last two, guys. Last one. Now we're going to bring it up and straddle. Here we go. Bring it up, straddle. Up, off. Tap it out. Up, straddle. Up, off. Add those arms when you're ready. Woo! How are we doing at home? Here we go. How my champions doing back there? Then we'll get into the meat of things. One more time. Woo! Okay, drop those arms. Bring it up once. Now tap it off. Give me a diagonal press. One to the corner. Over the top now. Two knees, push it back. Just two. Now hold for two taps right here. Doing a great job. Bring it up. Straddle from the top. Diagonal cross. Woo! Over the top. Two knees, push it back. Here we go. Woo. Guys, hold for two taps. Okay, next time this will be two turn steps. Bring it up, straddle from the top. All right. Now remember when you hear me say from the top, that's the straddle. Pump the arms. Woo. Okay, keep those arms up. Turn step, turn step. Don't forget. Okay, bring it up, straddle. Hell, how you doing back there? Okay. Over the top. Two feet back. Okay, guys. Two turns. All right. Let's go through it one more time. Both sides. Here we go. Then we'll add on. How's everybody doing? How do you feel out there? Doing great, I'm sure. <laughs> Turn two. Here we go. Okay. One more time from the top. One more time from the top. Here we go. Okay. Diagonal cross. Over the top. Two knees. Switch it back. Switch it back. Okay, keep those arms pumping. Two turns. Two. Okay, adding on. No arms. Repeat your knees for three. Here we go. Now we've got to step off the back. Other side. Okay. Do it again. Do it again. Again. Okay, now that you have it, let me see some arms. Here we go. Now, now what, am I, what does my crew say right here? 
over the top. Two, knee, back, push it back. Two, turn two. How do you feel out there? Doing great. Repeat it. Okay, remember, single knee, up, down, tap. Here we go. Lateral raise. Bring it to me. Hamstring curl. Over the top. Knee up. Lateral. Hamstring. Over the top. Okay, guys, hold. Adding on. Top it out. Top it out, too. Okay, we're going to add on. Lateral raise. Okay. Now, lateral raise, straddle. Four. Okay, just get used to that.
Look at the chart and make sure you're working in the appropriate training zone. Hi, I'm Janice. When you're ready to join me in this basic step, right foot leads. And we're going to take the intensity up a little bit, but be sure that you keep working in your training zone, okay? Are you ready, girls? We're ready! Are you ready? Oh, yeah! All right, then we're going to get started with an alternating step. Yeah. Three more times this side. Two more. Last one. Here we go. Take it across. And step. Other way. We're going to call this a travel step, or a turn step. So whenever you hear me say that, this is a move that we do. Okay, here comes the add-on. Shake your tap up and down. Good. Two more. Disco. Last one. Now here comes the turn. Turn once. Stay tap up and down. That's great. Two more. Last one. Here's your arms. Turn. Stay here. Tap up and down. There you go. You got it. Last one. Let's turn it. Stay here. Tap up and down. You can always watch Joy and Tamara for the arms. Here comes a turn and a change. One tap up and down. Now watch me follow them. I'm going to come up to the corner. To the corner. Let's do that again. It's up to the corner. Corner. And down one more. Up to the corner. Now here comes that turn. Here we go. One tap up and down. Join me up on top when you're ready. Up to the corner. To the corner. Do it again. Up to the corner. To the corner. And down last time. Okay, here comes that turn. Peter three. Other way. Good. Now we stay on this side. Tapping down. 
go. It looks like this. Just four moves. One knee. One straight leg. One calf up. Now come on back with an L. Good. Again, show me the knee. Show me the straight leg. Show me the calf up. Show me the L. Good. Do it again. How are you doing? Give me that. Hey. Hey. It's a straight leg. Now it's a calf up. Now come on back to Right here. Here are the arms.
last. All step back through. Good. This way, this way. Straight leg. You got it. Okay. Okay, we're gonna take it to the top one last time. Turn in. Yep, up and down. Now give it to me again this time. Stay out there. Good. Here comes the swim. You guys ready? Oh. Stay here. Tap up and down. All the way over. Disco. Here comes a hamstring curl. Give it to me. Disco. Uh, I like that. Uh, it helps Disco. to work harder, doesn't it? <laughs> Three repeater knees. Once, twice, three times. Oh, we're having a great time. Stay right here. Here come another hamstring curl. Oof. Oof. Straight leg. Good. All right, repeat your knees. This is going to be our last time through. Just take it to the other side, and then we're going to march it out. Up and top. Right foot basic step right here. Very nice. Very good. All right, now I'm going to have to come on down. March it out the floor. Let's get ready to cool down. Give yourselves a big hand. Yeah. Okay, guys. Ready to cool down? Yeah. Let's get a little funky, get a little loose, and have some fun. Okay, here we go. Starting with four-step touch. Two more march. Here we go. Bring it up. Step touch. Out. March for eight. Touch. Okay, now right up on your step. Step touch for two. Up on your step. Here we go. March for eight. Next time, these marches will go around your step. Step, touch it up. Here we go. Step, touch it up. Woo! Ha! Take it around, guys. Now, right away, bring it up for a step, touch. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ha! Adding on from here. Take it around. Take it around. Adding on from here. Great find to your right. Great find. Great find. Take it back. Now, hold. March it out for eight. Great. Same foot. Same foot. Step, touch it up. Here we go. Ha! Have some fun, guys. Take it around. Take it around. Now, can we add some funky shoulders on this straight line? It doesn't seem to be a problem, huh? Woo! Ha! March it out. Next time, we'll do some funky arms with these marches. Bring it up. Bring it up. Bring it up. Ha! Hello. How are we doing, champ? Take it around. Woo! Great line. Woo! Ha! Ha! March it out. Give me some arms, guys. Up. Push, push, bring it up. Ha. Whoop. Take it around. Whoop. Whoop. Great find, great find. Ha. March it out with those funky arms. One more, one more time through. Here we go, guys. Bring it up. Now, on this time, march it around. We're going to change feet on those last marches. Okay, guys, then we're going to build the other side. We're going to build the other side. March now. Give me on. Now tap left. Step touch left on the ground. March it out. Hup. Now bring that step touch right up on the back step. Here we go. Woo, have some fun with it. March it out here. Next time these marches will go around your step. Bring it up. Bring it up. Here we go. Hup. Take it around. Woo. Now bring it up on your step. For step touch up on your step. Okay, guys. Great find, great find. Adding on. Help. Hold three marches. Having fun. Bring it up, guys. Here we go. Take it around. Let's go. Nice and funky, nice and loose. Great find, great find. Can we add some arms on this march? Come on, make it strong. Up, up. Head, head, hip, hip. Now open those legs, letters. Here we go. Fine, great fine. Ooh, now this is the last time through. March it out. Tap it. Bring it up. Here we go, guys. Take it around. Okay. Great fine, great fine. March it out. Eight taps, guys. Here we go. Tap. Move left. Here we go. Bring it up. Take it around. Find 
Wait, on, hey, little shoulder action. Joy, how you doing? Don't forget to tap and move left. Bring it up. Take it around. Woo. Here we go. Okay, march and hold. Now we're going to go right into step touch on the ground. Step touch, here we go. Shoulder back, guys, no touch. Keep those feet wide. Woo, take it down. Now, opposite shoulder to knee, last four. Here we go. Four, three, two, hold it here. Hold it here. Okay, let's take it around. Little calf stretch. Hold. Hold. Okay, take your right hand down to your chest. Keep that other leg back. Little hip flexor stretch. Feel that stretch. How does it feel? Okay, take that knee to the ground. Tuck the toe under. Little more hip flexor stretch right there. Hold it. Hold it. Okay, fully release back. Flex the front foot. Go off the knee. Drop your chest. Feel that stretch right through the hamstring. Hold it there. Hold it there. Okay, bend that knee underneath you. Hands on the side. Tuck the toe under the back. Stretch the body all the way up. Take it to the other side. Calf stretch first, guys. Ooh, feel it. We need that. Okay, slowly down. Hip flexor. Hold. Hold it there. Keep that ang right angle. Take the knee down. Tuck the toes. Hold it. Four more. Three. Two and one, slowly extend this front leg, relax, chest down, hold it there, hold it there, okay, bend that knee down underneath you guys, toe under in the back, extend that leg, now meet the left leg with your right, hand on your thighs, slowly roll it back, you guys ready for your pose? Hit it, ho! Okay, great job you guys! You guys, to make sure that you keep on stepping, stay healthy there, and don't forget there's only one original step, so step on it!